the hills of the Pennines hold a good population of Merlin. This immaculate male has already reared its young and will soon be moving out to the coast, or perhaps even further afield. The colours of autumn are beginning to show in the riverside woods. Great spotted woodpeckers are now commoner than they have ever been, and if not seen will certainly be heard in these woods. Above the industrial heartland of Manchester, running the full length of the Pennines, is the Pennine Way footpath. In the gravel of this path feeds a snow bunting. A few of these hardy birds winter in the Pennines each year. Flocks of twites are just as elusive, and this once common bird is now down to less than 200 breeding pairs in summer. Water rails are normally confined to feeding in dense cover, but this one has been forced out into the open by the severe conditions. It is dawn that produces the greatest number of wader calls. As it comes light, black grouse also fly in to join the waders. Peregrines also breed in the old quarries. This female rests on her favourite rock in the quarry. Tawny owls have now paired off and stand side by side before the female commences incubating eggs. The heron is fishing in a riverside weir. The male short-eared owl hunts extensively. His female loves voles. Green woodpeckers have noisy young. A side view shows two young leaning out to be fed. This idyllic Pennine stream is home to the most colourful bird of all, the kingfisher. In the pink sky of a summer's evening, the young barn owls will learn the art of catching voles. Let's hope there is always land available around the farm on the hill for future generations of barn owls.